Ah, Darklands, the game I love and hate to talk about. I've really struggled to trying to figure out how this video should work, so I'm just going to keep it as very brief as possible. For those who just need a recap on what Darklands is, it's basically a giant mixture of all of these systems and games featured with a variety of problems. From an overbloated rulebook, overly descriptive rules with subtitles upon subtitles, various repeats of words, and various sections that should not be repeated. Not so great formatting, and honestly just a load of other problems that you can, you can watch the first two videos about because that actually gives some support and I don't have to repeat myself. But besides all this, why do I keep talking about it? What else can I actually talk about the game with? To put it bluntly, no one else really talks about it, not even Mersha themselves, which I think is a shame because the game actually is pretty good when you actually stop and understand the rules and actually play the game, and plus, I love the models. The rules I previously mentioned are a problem, and the models, as I've also mentioned in the past, are, well, a little pricey. Which is why I want to announce three big announcements for the game. So on a personal matter, I'm actually taking the time to rewrite all the rules a bit. Well, rewrite is a bit of a overstatement. There's, I'm more trying to reword the rules so they're easier for people to understand. Kind of taking the philosophy of Warhammer 10th edition right now of simplifying but not simple. There is still a lot of tactical depth in this game that you can definitely have. I just think people need to actually be able to understand the rules. I mean, I showed my friend the rules beforehand and good lord, his, his face started melting. And besides, this has also been a project I've been working on since 1st edition, and if you also watch my video on 2nd edition, which, again, you should watch, not really much has changed, and it hasn't really affected my progress. You know, I also think it would just be a good thing to, like, try to continue giving Mersha as much support. This is not in any way meant to, like, derail them or, like, upstage them. I really just want to try and help them. And by simplifying the rules just a little bit in terms of overall wording, I think that will get more people into the game instead of just having them flee away in terror after realizing the rulebook is, like, a full-length novel. So then what are the two official announcements? Well, for starters, even though in their last Kickstarter they said they would not do STL files, they're now doing STL files. But yeah, uh, shortly after the second video, they started a Patreon and a My Mini Factory, about $12. That's typically like a good average. I've actually tested some of these models. And, and if you're not a member of Patreon or you just kind of want to do more one-time deals, that's perfectly fine. You can go into My Mini Factory and buy them roughly for 50 bucks, I believe. And again, so, you know, if you want to just at least try out their models that way, you are not really wanting to, like, pay the outrageous cost or even, like, try to get free shipping in that manner, go do that. But I will also say right now, if you do want to go that method, guess what? There's now a giant summer sale going on. It's just been extended. I really have been trying to, like, get this out there. Again, I love the miniatures. You don't even need to buy this stuff for Darkland. Browse their range, see for something that you want to play for like your next hero, RPG, whatever. Just go do it. I really want to give Mersha as much support as I can because quite honestly, someone on the internet needs to. So go, buy, go now. No. 